one. There you are I ain't done nothing. Only if I can you help it. Among us but damn if I ain't almost sober. Hey, in the bannered mare, there's this bottle of Argonian ale. The good stuff. Get it for me. They won't even know it's gone. Come on. Then we got nothing more to talk about. Where my bread is long sure, whatever. winter. You have come. You have come to hear the word of Talos. Because the so-called emperor is a coward. That's right. I said coward. Oh, yes. He agreed to banish the worship of Talos at the tip of an Aldmeri sword. They called it the White Gold Concordant. Well, I call it blasphemy. A true son of the Empire would never have turned his back on our greatest hero. Not at any price. Well, let me tell you something, friend. Cyrodiil is a long way from here. And in Skyrim, we will never forsake mighty Talos. <laughs> Let them come. I have no fear, for Talos is my ally, and I am his prophet. His word is upon my lips, his voice in my throat. Hello, my friend. If you seek knowledge about mighty Talos, you have most certainly come to the right person. In mortal life, Talos was a Nord, possessed of unmatched tactical skill, limitless wisdom, and the power to see into men's hearts. Talos mastered the power of the Voice, and with it he united the lands of men into a great empire. In southern lands, he was known by the name Tiber Septim. Here in Skyrim, we honor him by his proper Nord name. So great was his reign in life. When he ascended to the heavens, he was made Lord of the Divines. If you want to know more, I'm sure you can find any number of tomes on the subject. I love, love, even as man. What is it? Are those two at it again? Come on now. Cross the purple. Keep your balance. This should be good. Fight! Come on! Damn you! Get him! I'll sort of burst you! Just keep swinging! Why would you even come to your Vasker without knowing what we stand for? This is not play acting here. We are the true spirit of Skyrim. Honor is in our blood, death in our hearts. If you see Geyser, you found the right place. Soon enough, it'll be me. In the meanwhile, the Circle handles our daily routine. And Codlack advises them as harbinger. About you and Skior. Fortune and, and glory, friend. Fortune and glory. Is it not allowed? Mm -hmm. exactly mm-hmm. I'd be dead if so not for Vignar. Took so me in and helped me turn my life. I had a bad time a few years back, and I turned to drink. But Vignar, he wouldn't let me stay weak. To hear Vignar tell it, a bunch of layabouts and useless viners who used to know how to fight. But he thinks everything used to be better. I, for one, would trust any companion with my life. Oh, I'm not a companion myself. I just help Vigna. All these he took me in when I was having a tough time and... Well, I owe him. 
Some of them might try. And we've done as much as we can to prepare for that. But remember, White Run is home to the companions. Any dragon that comes here will get more than he's bargained for. I think. Farewell, sir. What are you doing that for? You look worse than I feel. I haven't seen you before, have I? Have we met? I'm sorry if I've forgotten. We're the best damn fighters in Skyrim. At least, some of us are. In charge of what? I'm in charge of me, and you're in charge of you. If you're looking to join up, Codlack's the one to be talking to. A man of my station has many debts. I'm not much use at labor or learning, but I can throw a punch with the best of them. The companions let me fight for gold, and so I fight. Until next time. If you wish to hunt with me, your feet need to be quick and your eyes quicker. An outsider, eh? Never heard of the companions? An order of warriors. We are brothers and sisters in honor. And we show up to solve problems if the coin is good enough. Codlack says not to worry about it. I worry that a bunch of snowberries are out there earning glory while we stay out of it. But I will follow the old man's lead, as ever. My mother was a companion, and her mother, and all the women in my family back to Harati Blackblade. I stayed with my father in the woods until I was old enough for my trial. We hunted everything there was to hunt. Good training. Ma didn't live long enough to see me join, but I fight to honor her and all my S.H.I.E.L.D. sisters through time. We don't just take in any milk drinker who stumbles in. Talk to Codlack if you think you have what it takes to be a companion. I'll take my leave then. Ah, fresh blood. We Grey Maids have been feuding with the Battleborns for years. There's no more bitter enemy than an old friend. Aye, they're an old clan like ours. But they cast their lot with the Empire when the uprising began. Olfred Battleborn made his money from farming Are you prepared and got himself time? some new friends among the Empire's nobles. Now he's in the Emperor's pocket like the rest of them, with no regard for honor and tradition. No, they used to be something. Nowadays, they just squabble amongst themselves. Take my advice and keep away. You look too smart to get caught up with this bunch. Well, when you get to be my age, you don't remember why you did much of anything. Only that it happened. I... We used to be fast friends. Though it was long ago. We were two of the city's oldest and most respected clans. And we could trace our histories all the way back to Isgrimor's companions. But... Then Olford got rich, and decided he and his kin were too good for us simple, backwards Nord folk. When the troubles began, he took the Empire's side. We haven't spoken much since then. Aye, we were too... When the troubles began, he... Oh, we've got an old saying. The Grey Manes have lived in White Run since the first snows fell in Skyrim. Well, maybe that's not entirely true, but our clan's got a long and proud history in this old. We respect the old ways, the Nord ways, and the Grey Mane has worked the Skyforge since before the time of my grandfather's father. I was done talking anyway. Ah, fresh blood. Hope you know how to handle yourself. My brother Vilkas is a better talker than me. He should be around someplace. <laughs> Vilkas and I have been here since we were little whelps. Our father Jurgen raised us here. Even Vigner couldn't remember companions younger than us. Too confusing for me. Empire, Nords, Talos, who cares? Just tell me who needs bludgeoning. The Companions are my family. 
We fight so that other people don't have to. We bring honor and glory to ourselves and each other. Kodlak is the one who figures out who can be a companion, so talk to him. It's out of my hands. All right, then. Yes, yes, I haven't got all day. Are you looking to join? I wouldn't get your hopes up. The short answer is, we fight. The long answer is, uh, forget it. You're not worth my time. You don't just waddle in here and get to speak to the boss. Who do you think you are? If you want to embarrass yourself, I won't stop you. Kodlak is the harbinger. He's the closest thing you'll find to a leader around here. So I wouldn't have to answer stupid questions from idiots. All right, then. The rest will go along quite so easily. Leave that to me. A stranger comes to our hall. Your question carries more weight than you may know, newcomer. The sort of thing some of us spend our lives pondering. The difference between a noble band of warriors and a ragged bunch of assassins is as thin as a blade's edge. I try to hold us to the right path. Politics are something best avoided. I prefer more personal confrontations myself. Like most of our band, I found this family after losing my own. I traveled the length and breadth of this land, learning all I could of the sword and the axe. I was just a boy, but I had the fire of a man in my heart. Eventually, my body caught up to my spirit. My predecessor, Asgar, found me in Hammerfell. I was serving as a bodyguard for some weak-necked lord out there. He brought me back here, and I realized that I was actually coming home. I worked to bring honor to this family, and to the family that I lost. For my mother, my father, and my grandfather. For all my S.H.I.E.L.D. siblings. Family and honor. That's what it means to be one of us, boy. Would you now? Here, let me have a look at you. Mm. Yes, perhaps. A certain strength of spirit. Master, you're not truly considering accepting him. I am nobody's master, Vilnius. And last I checked, we had some empty beds in Yorvaskar for those with a fire burning in their hearts. Apologies, but perhaps this isn't the time. I've never even heard of this outsider. Sometimes the famous come to us. Sometimes men and women come to us to seek their fame. It makes no difference. What matters is their heart. And their arm. Of course. How are you in battle, boy? That may be so. This is Vilkas. He will test your arm. Vilkas, take him out to the yard and see what he can do. Aye. What kind of weapon do you prefer? I like the small blades. Yes, you're very fond of saying that. You know I like hammers and axes. Aren't they slow? I can get in and out before you have one swing. Let's test that out some.
My brother Vilkas is a better talker than me. He should be around someplace. said to have a look at you so let's do this just have a few swings at me so i can see your form don't worry i can take it never should have come here <laughs> not that next time won't be so easy you might just make it but for now you're still a wealth to us new blood so you do what we tell you. Here's my sword. Go take it up to Jorlin to have it sharpened. And be careful. It's probably worth more than you are. Let's get going. You've been talking to those companions? Too hot-headed, they cried. Weak, pathetic cowards, the lot of them. You have to remember, it's not about strength. It wasn't my fault. I told them over and over that it was an accident. They wanted me to prove my worth. So they threw me up against a young whelp of a lad, hardly old enough to grow his first chin hairs. I guess they thought a woman wasn't strong enough to hurt him. I didn't mean for him to die. Why would I want that? I just... I just lost control. Go on ahead. I'll stand guard. We going? I'm heading home, if you need me. What brings you here? I'm guessing you're the newcomer then. Oh, don't worry too much about it. They were all whelps once. They just might not like to talk about it. And don't always just do what you're told. Nobody rules anybody in the Companions. Well, I'm not sure how they've managed it, but they have. No leader since Ysgrimor. Kodlak is the harbinger, and he's a sort of advisor for the whole group. But every man is his own, every woman her own. Not actually a companion myself, but none of them know how to work a forge properly, and I'm honored to serve them. My name is Eorlin Greymane. I work the Skyforge, best steel in all of Skyrim, all of Tamriel. I have a favor to ask. I've been working on a shield for Aela. My wife is in mourning, and I need to get back to her soon. I'd be much obliged if you could take this to Aela for me. This isn't a command, just decency. Help out an old blacksmith. I've got to get back to my work. Are you feeling all right, dear? If you wish to hunt with me, your feet need to be quick and your eyes quicker. Good, I've been waiting for this. Wait, I remember you. So the old man thinks you've got some heart, I guess. You know this one? I saw him training in the yard with Vilkis. 
Ah, yes. I heard you gave him quite a thrashing. Don't let Vilkas catch you saying that. Do you think you could handle Vilkas in a real fight? Ah, a man of action. Here, let's have Farkas show you where you'll be resting your head. Farkas. Did you call me? Of course we did, Ice Brain. Show this new blood where the rest of the whelps sleep. New blood? Oh, I remember you. Come on, follow me. Skior and Ayala like to tease me, but they're good people. They challenge us to be our best. Nice to have a new face around. It gets boring here sometimes. I hope we keep you. This can be a rough life. The quarters are up here. Just pick a bed and fall in it when you're tired. Tilma will keep the place clean. She always has. All right, so here you are. Looks like the others are eager to meet you. Come to me or Ayala if you're looking for work. Once you've made a bit of a name for yourself, Skior and Vilkas might have things for you to do. Good luck. Welcome to the Companions. By the way, if you're looking for something to do, we've gotten a letter about someone needing some muscle right here in Whiterun Hold. I don't know what the fight is about, and that's not our business anyway. I just need you to go out there, look tough, and scare this milk drinker into submission. No more than that. I don't want to hear about a killing, understand? One day when you and I are Try not to get carried away. By the way, if you're looking for something to do... They're lording it over us all the time, though. I've been tending to the warriors of Yorbaskar for as long as I can remember. Recruit, right? Wait, is that right? You look worse than I feel. <laughs> 